let's use the passcode and get in. Nice. Jeez, are the G3 even trying to domesticate the local mites? I really want you to use my glob shot. Holy shit, looks like the G3 ran into trouble. I mean, maybe they'll sort this out themselves. It's nice to kill something guilt free, you know? Is this the entrance to the mines? Jesus, they really fucked this place up. I didn't know it had gotten this bad. These guys just don't let up, do they? I know this little guy's barely even down. Oh shit, Grinkus. Gotta be honest, uh, you know, they're, they're working for the G3, but still better than our friend from earlier.
You know? Okay, great. Whew. All right, now let's try that elevator. Okay, this should take us down into the mines. Going down, huh? Sorry, I, I almost made a crest joke, but I'm, I'm gonna save it. I'm gonna save it. We're better than that. No crest jokes for me. That's a promise. Not for me, anyways. You might warp in some bases and. Lord only knows, but you know, from me over here as a gun, character, sidekick, no crass jokes. 100% on the level with you and no bad stuff. Fuck, it stopped? Ticket and some way to find out what this is. Let's get to work.
Did we get something good? Hey you, care to make a purchase from the quartermaster? I wanted to call this place what I was The proceeds from every purchase goes directly to the G3. Wait, I forgot to ask if you'd like to donate a few pesos to Krubus's birthday party fund. Uh, all the other moplets hate the G3 so much, but life before they get that money goes right to the G3, you know. The G3 thanks you. Attention, Mayan Operation 12C. It's me, Krubus. Speed things up! I'm fucking underwater here trying to keep things on schedule. And I figured, maybe you forgot that if you piss me off, I will kill you. It's really easy to find more slaves. So just do your job and mine more Virgos. Krubus out. Holy shit, hey, he's got a galleon. We gotta rescue it. Mining Operation 12C, this is Krubus again. One of you weird moplet fucks just delivered me a batch of defective Virgos. You wanna know how I know that defective? Because dead! Looks like most of them got crushed in a cave-in. And I punished the moplets responsible, but it looks like they died in the cave-in too. Don't let it happen again. What's up, fuckers? It's me. Krubus again. Someone filled out the wrong shipping destination uh, on an entire uh, stack of rainbow. Form 40 Qs. You fucked up my whole day when you did that. Just come forward and tell me whose fault it was. I wish I could promise you I won't kill you, but I'm definitely gonna kill you! Hey, it's Krubus again. Just bored this time. I've been standing at the paper call. Mantuous always stick me with the paperwork. Doesn't he know I have fucking drills for hands? For one thing, that means I should be drilling, and for another. And for another, it means I, I, I keep shredding all this important fucking paperwork! I just got off the phone with corporate. 
the new hires coming in today. No, <laughs> no, I don't know what they look like. Why is that your first question? I don't know, Merle. <laughs> Maybe it's because we work in an office and don't ask for fucking headshots with our applications. <laughs> no, exactly. I literally have no idea what they look like. If someone were to walk in right now, I would just assume they were the new hire. Yes, anyone off the street. I don't care. No, I, that's the difference between you and me, okay? Is that I let life happen to me. You, you try to control it. Oh, get it in your grips. Well, guess what? You're gonna learn a lesson real quick. You can't fight the ocean. And that's why I'm sitting here in a steady administrative assistant position and you, where are you? In a lazy boy recliner, accepting donations from a uh, passerby. <laughs> yeah, that's exactly what I said. I said, you're a beggar. That is the, I didn't use those words, but thank you for giving that vocabulary to me. I appreciate it. Mm-hmm. Well, <laughs> the reason I'm here is, you know what, Dad? I've had enough. <laughs> I love you to pieces, and I am hanging up. Uh, excuse me? I'm so sorry. I didn't see you there. I'm Helen. I just need to know, are you the new hire or the new boss? Uh, yeah, sure. You know, we're here to work. <laughs> Fantastic. You look sharp. <laughs> I think the team's really going to like you, hon. Let's get y'all set up. Head on into the next room and find a place to work. Go on without me. I haven't left this chair in years, and I don't plan to start now. <laughs> Honey, I can't wait out here all day. The bathrooms are for employees only, and you have not made it clear whether you work here. Oh, thank God they're here. Hey, you must be the new office clerk, right? Just sort through that paperwork for us. We're so small. Uh, sure. Uh, yes. I will see what I can do. Oh, jeez. Okay, this is more paperwork than I anticipated. All right, better get to work. So, we still good for Hyper Feast later? What time did you shake him? Uh, Zorg. Oh, yeah. Zorg totally works. Hey, newbie. You know Hyper Feast? They create new life in front of you, and you get to eat it alive? Shit's wild, man. Hyper Feast. <laughs> See you there, girlfriend. You're my girlfriend. We're dating. Oh my god, I'm going insane. I'm going fucking nuts. What? Yeah, I, uh, god, I think my brain's breaking. I, I think doing this job is making my brain break completely. Oh, yeah, me too, me too. It's fun. You don't mind your brain breaking? And done, finally! Well, you don't mind this, this fucking monotonous nightmare work? No, no, it's nice. It's cool to just get into a broken brain. I can't do math anymore. And if I stay here another year, I think I'll forget how to say three-syllable words. Okay, that honestly doesn't sound so bad. It's not bad. It's terrific. Fantastic. Amazing. Three words I won't be able to say next year, so savor them now. Oh, buddy, I will. You know, I, I kind of don't mind this at all. Hey, what time did we say for Hyper Feast again? <sighs> don't you listen to anything? We said Zorg. Zorg. Ah, right, right. Damn. I just remembered I had something going on at Zorg. Ow, paper cut. <laughs> just all kidding. in a day's uh, work. Been you oh, you would have got that the all gone. The there are, there definitely is not going to be a third what? stack. Oh, I didn't see you there. Ah, uh, the cold here. sting of irony. Is is that ironic? I, I never really know. Oh, I didn't see you there. Do you, do you still sit here? That's so funny. Yeah, this is still my spot. Okay, yeah, that makes sense. It does, it does, yeah. I, I, I think if I if I sit back down at my desk, my soul is just going to leave my body. Okay, well, I've got work to do. Yeah, I know, me too. I, I, I have to do all this fucking work. This is the whole fucking problem, man. Look. Just because we used to be married doesn't mean you can keep leaning on me to work through your issues. That was one night. We got married for one dumb night and had 16 kids. You need to leave me alone. Oh, jeez, yeah. No, I'm, I'm so sorry. I, 
I didn't mean to bother you like that. Uh, it, it, it's fine. Just laugh. Oh, okay, we're done. No more paperwork. Did you hear me? I said no more paperwork. Not even a fourth stack. Okay, good. God damn, you filled out those papers like a son of a bitch. Like a real bitch you are. Fuck you. You're, you're promoted. You're free to go into Krubus' office. Why? Because fuck you. That's why I don't need a fucking reason. I'm Boss McBossington. And I'll be in here jerking off or whatever. And fucking other stuff too. I don't, I don't give a shit. I didn't mean to bother you like that. It's it's fine. Just please, just let me get back to work. I gotta be honest. I totally forgot we used to be married and had sixteen kids together. That that's not why I came over here. I I just think you're nice and, and pretty and good at listening. Really? Because I am. I, I'm nice and good at listening. Oh yeah, I I know that very well. Wow. Well, I I think you're nice and good at listening too. And you have a very hot body. Oh my god, thank you. <laughs> That's so nice. Um, hey, would, would you maybe, like, want to get some drinks tonight? Uh, like, maybe around Zorg? Oh, uh, I, I made plans tonight. <sighs> Actually, yes. I'm free. I'd love that. See you at Zorg. Huh, so this must be Krubus' office. There's got to be something here we can use. Wait, I feel like we missed something in there, you know? Krubus, where are you? This is Garmantuous. I just checked the log and you're three days behind schedule with the latest shipment. But you know what? It's not that big of a fucking deal. These Fergals aren't gonna be worth shit now that we discovered humans. Might even have to shut this whole operation down just to get all hands on deck over on Earth. I can give your territory to the Screndel Brothers and have them expand their facilities to find out more about these humans. Oh, have you tried one of these fuckers yet? Oh, God, the high? It's otherworldly. Can't believe a species like this really exists. Humans! <laughs> Who'd have even thought? Anyway, don't fuck up again, even if it doesn't matter, or I'll smoke you myself. Oh, would you look at that? He, he marked his coordinates on the calendar. Shit. All right, now we just need a blank warp disk to encode this on. to try manual labor for once, but, uh, turns out it's not so satisfying when you're a slave. This is really tough work. Mining Operation 12C! This is Krubus again! According to all the hot monitors we forcibly implanted in all you mo- You're working at 8% less efficiency today than you were yesterday! Fuck you! Don't do that! Work harder! 
We got a lot of Fergus in mind. And if you want to keep up with the next week's shipment, and yeah, we probably have an easier time in quote if I didn't smoke so many of the Fergus, but fuck you! I'm the boss! We're here to help. What, 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 what's going on? Ah, don't, don't get me in trouble. No, no, it's okay. We're friends. We, we hate the G3, too. Oh, wonderful. Thank God. <gasps> Listen, we're looking for a blank warp disk. Do, do you have any ideas? Ah, yes. Our prince has a stash of them. Really? All you need to do is clear out the warp base the G3 plopped on in our holy land. Then you'll reclaim the sacred grounds and rescue Prince Chosen One. And then he'll give us a blank disc? Yes, so oh, yes, we can, we can help each other. Oh, what a fortuitous happenstance. Oh. Is his name really Prince Chosen One? Yes. He was named as such according to the prophecy. And then after that, he was made into a prince. So you trust your leaders to prophecies. <laughs> Is he a good prince? Well, the prophecy doesn't guarantee he's going to be good at his job. It just tells us who to pick. Look, I, I, I don't know. I don't know. Look, if now's not the time to criticize us. We're, I'm just, you know, we're distressed as it is. I'm just doing my job. So, what's your plan? We have started a resistance. Not only do the G3 enslave us, but they have desecrated our holiest of sites and absconded with our sweet prince. Prince Chosen One, that's, that's him. Prince Chosen One. Oh, that's awful! So, so you kidnapped this G3 merc as a bargaining chip to get your prince back? Oh, hmm. Yeah, that's smart. No, we, we didn't think of that at all. But it's fine, we know where the prince is. <gasps> they swapped him out with the rest of our sacred grounds when they warped in a new base. So you want us to go clear it out and then warp <gasps> the throne room back? Oh, heavens! Would you really do all that for us? The base is just past this tunnel. Thank you, thank you, thank you. All right, we are off! Wow, you know, we, we're about to rescue a prince. You know, I'm, I'm a little nervous. You know, I, I hope he lives up to the hype. Hey, listen, when has a prince ever let anyone down? You know what I mean? Oh shit, this must be the place. Okay, let's clear it out.
Great, now let's see if there's a disc in here. Okay, let's head back outside and use this to reverse the warp. appropriate and what the hell do you want jeez it jeez we, we just saved you you know maybe you could be a little grateful saved me from what i'm fine look we were told you had some sort of blank warp disc huh yeah 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 sure i've got a bunch Okay, we got everything we need. Let's get back to Ranchi's place and see if he, you know, can help us encode them onto this machine. Prince Chosen One has returned. All has been restored. Prince Chosen One, I am so sorry, but we're out of Klagorsh. Can I interest you in some Plagorb? I don't want Plagorb. I want Klagorsh! You said that you wouldn't run out of Klagorsh again. You promised. I don't even know why I stick around here. If I leave, you're all zig dang blue. Just try and find a chosen one better than me. I dare you. Oh, no, 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 no. Please, please. It is already written in the prophecies. Set in stone for eons to come. You are the chosen one. There is no other. Do not dare us. Exactly. Yet you're out of Klagorsh again. Tell me where that makes sense. Just tell me, there's a real disconnect going up. We're so sorry, Chosen, Chosen One. Uh, what about my lumbar support? I thought you were gonna get something for my lumbar. It's killing me. I get warped out by G3 Maniacs, and I get back, and my lumbar is in dire need of support. I look around me, and I don't see any ding-dang support. And on top of it all, there's no Klagorsh! We are so, so undeserving. Klagorsh is hard to come by. Forgive us, Prince Chosen One. I'm finding that pretty hard these days. I'm going through a lot of stuff. Maybe you think it's easy being chosen, but it ain't. I'd love to see one of you guys be chosen. I gave you your warp disc, now get the fuck out of here!
let's let's head inside. Hey, uh, you're back! Ah, oh, thank God! Thank fucking God! Uh, did you bring my Fergal? Uh, I need a bed. Uh, I need my fix, kid. Uh, I need a bed. I need it real bad. Oh Jesus Christ, man! Hey, are you all right? Uh, are you are you having a heart attack or or? Is it, is it Fergal withdrawals? Does that make you happy? Oh, you love that, don't you? You love to see a uh, master of industry all flummoxed like this, all low and... Uh, yeah, maybe. Maybe. Uh, uh, maybe this is a bad time, but c could we use your disc encoder real quick? What? No! The encoder is off limits until I get my goddamn Fergal fix. F Fergals. Get them. H hurry. Hurry. Uh, hey, tell you what, we're gonna go ahead and use the disc encoder while you're sort of, uh, stuck on the ground like that, doing whatever it is you're doing. So, don't be mad at us. Fuck. Fuck. All right, looks like it's working. All right, there we go. Time to warp in Krubus and then, you know, kill him. If, 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 if we're able to. You ready? I don't, I don't feel so good at all. Oh, I'm so cold. Now I'm so hot. Oh, I'm fucking boiling. Did someone turn on the AC? Oh no. Really? I don't smell oh, anything. No, it I... smells just fine in here. Shit. Oh, I shit myself. Oh, oh no. I pissed myself. And the piss is mixing with the shit into a shit piss. And it's all under me. And I'm, I'm just lying in my own shit piss. Don't look, don't look. Like, don't come near me. I just, what the fuck you want to see that for? What's wrong with you? What's wrong with you? You get a kick out of it? I want to see a man lying and sweating in his own shit piss. You're a pervert. I fucking hate you. You don't even like me. You pretended to be my best friend. And you betrayed me. Please, give me burgles. Hey, I've got a crazy idea. What if we just swap out this mansion for Krubus's base?
Stretch my drills like this. Kill me. No one says you can't get an eye off your own supply. Seems like they have you doing all the boring paperwork shit over here, so you can't be too strong. I'm getting dirt in my mouth. This fucking sucks. Eat shit, you jack off. Let's lob it to him. How dare you fuck with me when you don't do a job that has you do paperwork, you asshole. Up there, wasn't I? Sorry about that. Ooh. Hey, bud, the name's Gus. Feel good to meet you. Look at you, man. Pretty slick taking out Krubus like that, rescuing me from indentured servitude, etc. etc. I love that kind of stuff. No, I love that. That's the kind of stuff I love, man. Do you mind if I tag along with you for a bit? I, of course. I, I, that's what I was hoping. Say we can use your help, but I should be clear that we are trying to take down the whole G3 cartel and we might die. Music to my ears. You think I don't want to take down the cartel? Buddy, that's all I want to do. That's all I dream about. Amazing, God, I'm so glad to find another Gatlian alive and well. I love your tiny little hands, by the way. I, I, I had a cousin who had those tiny hands. He died in the zombie apocalypse on Gatlas, but you know, look, I'm sure you don't want to hear about that. We had to live through it. I mean, you know, who wants to talk about that? Oh shit, time to fight. Oh, ho, okay. Quit waiting now, time. Hey, no, no. I 
just said use the vacuum. Use the damn vacuum. <laughs> hmm, still a little far away. I'm not sure you can jump to that. Ugh, do I have to do fucking everything? Combo time. Use me to tether over to that desk. Oh, hey, it's me, Quentin and Quentin again, your best friend. I actually decided to patch things up and rejoin the Jake 3. Do you mind if I kill you real quick? <laughs> Let's see how much you talk when you're dead. Finally, enough of that guy. They kicked him out of the G3 because he was so damn annoying. He's lonely, he's bitter, and get a life. Some people need a life, and he needed a life, man. Freedom, baby. I already felt free when you saved me from Kubis. But now that you're out of the pit, I really feel free. My this is red. Let's do it. Get the fuck out of here! Hell yeah! The G3 is going to have to step up their recruitment. What did I do to piss you off? Shit. And don't make me get my brass fucking knuckles! I'll kill you! And get out of here! Yeah, whatever! Whatever! Just fuck! Move it! Learn how to drive, asshole! Hey, you wanna... Uh, uh, that's what you sound like! You sound like... Alright! Finally! It's been a hot second! But yeah.
Jim Cool's back. You think I'm supposed to be impressed that you killed a G3 officer? Y well, okay, yeah, fine. I am. I think it's pretty insane you didn't die. That's all you're getting out of me. Now, turn that bounty in. You got yourself another talking gun? And this one's green? Wow, who cares? No one. Oh, okay, okay, that's fine. Be rude. My name is Gus, not that it matters to you. There we go. Look at you. You're getting the hang of this bounty hunter thing already. How'd the mission go? They killed a G3. Looks like I taught them well. Wow, really? Whoa, okay. Well, I'm impressed. <laughs> I was, I was always hoping you'd find your calling. I just I didn't think it would be bounty hunting. But then again, I don't know what I thought it would be. Maybe hairstyling and not good at it. And what's wrong with bounty hunting? Ugh, can you please tell this dried up sack of shit to go home? I don't want to share a couch with him. Tough titties, Leslie. You're kidding me, had a deal. It's Lizzie! And that's not my kid. Jesus, we're siblings. Sorry, I don't know how your species works yet. Sibling, fine, got it. Doesn't change a thing. I live here now. Come on, can't he find his own place to stay? Hey, that's not right. I'm barely taking up any space. You know we had a deal fair and square. Oh, come on! We barely know this guy! You're really gonna side with him over your own sister? Hey, you should be proud! You raised your child to have proper respect for a good, fair business deal. Oh, now I know you're doing this on purpose. I'm the sister, not the mom. But you knew that, didn't you? Sorry. My bad. You come waltzing back in here stinking like dirty Flimborg, of course I'm gonna get distracted. You shouldn't be hanging out with that Flimborg boy, you know? Can't trust that species. Tweak's harmless and nice. You're being spacist. And he's not my boyfriend. Yet. Trust me, Flimborgs are bad news. Come on, have my back here. Whoa, really? Uh, you don't have to side with this guy just because he gave you some cool toys. Plus, I feel like he's just using you. Look, I appreciate the loyalty, kid, but I am actually a bit of a spacist. I'm trying to work on it. God, I just don't think I can take much more of this guy. What, you think this is easy for me? If I'm pissing you off, at least you can leave. But my legs don't work. I'm stuck listening to your boy trouble every time I'm trying to watch my stories. I can't even get peace and quiet in my own home because there's an alien cripple jerking off on my couch 24-7. Hey, c come on. That's a high estimate. Ew, I was kidding. Yeah, me too. I was kidding. We all know I was kidding. Aren't you going to say anything? Whose side are you on anyway? Hey, uh, all right, I, I, I can see I'm being a little bit of a bother. I mean, look, I'll, I'll try to keep it down when I'm uh, watching my stories. Just don't uh, put me back on the streets. I, I really do want to help you. Fine, he can stay, but only until he finds somewhere else to go. I'm grateful, I mean it. But I've already missed half my program, so can everyone just shut the hell up? Ugh. All right, that's enough excitement for one day. You got more bounties to get to, kid. And you might want to check out the pawn shop to see what you can spend your new payout on. Eh? <sighs> Oof, that was tense. It's times like these I'm, I'm almost relieved I don't have any family left alive. But, but not really. I, I miss them a lot. Hey, uh, just so you know, you can use the Bounty 5000 to revisit any planet you've been before. There's portal doors all over. You can just uh, use them whenever and grind for money, look for loot you missed, whatever. Up to you. Just thought I'd tell you. 